Right, folks, it's Sunday night. It's a quarter past seven. Nights are drawing in, isn't they, June? They are. Depressing times we have coming up. Wow. Eh? It's Halloween. Halloween, yeah, it's Halloween tonight. They can fuck off. Come knocking on our door asking for crisps and sweets. They can bugger off. They're all mine. I'm not into that. Bloody American shite coming over here, dressing up and scaring people and and people getting offended by fancy dress costumes. Fuck off. Uh, right, I've been to Aldi uh, in Loughborough uh, near uh, Greg's. That one there near Cost, Cost, Cost not Costco, just Cost, Costa Coffee. And uh, ooh, a bit like Larry. Gra oh. Larry Grayson there, or is it uh, Frank? Frankie Howard, he used to do that, didn't he? Oh. oh, shut your face. Um, another classic British comedian of our day that will be only remembered on videos and stuff, you know. Don't have none of him no more. Don't have any Frankie Howards knocking around and that, do we, June? No, did you not. Did you like Frankie Howard? I did. I like Frankie Howard. Up oh, Pompeii and all that. Hey, Titter ye not, remembers June. Uh, sorry, I went in Audi, and uh, I do like going into Audi because although I'm not a beer reviewer, I do like beer and I do like to give my opinion. Um, there is a lot of beer tubers out there. Uh, some are really good, some are boring as fuck, some I can't be arsed with. Um, are you giggling, June? No. All right. Are you no. sure? It must have been wind then. You must have, you must have squoze a squeaker out. Um, so I picked this up. Uh, I bought two of these. Uh, this is a black and gold one. The other one's a black and silver one. Um, and it said the new. Well, I thought I'd reviewed something like this before, um, but it turns out I've not. And as I was looking through YouTube, I typed in, because I've done that many reviews now, I can't remember what I've fucking done, I can't remember what I've said. People leave comments on videos saying I said something, I went, did I really say that? So anyway, you go back through the video, you think, oh, for fuck's sake, you have, why you said that? And it's because I switch off, I switch off, I just go into, like, Dave mode. So, June, the dog's fighting himself with his reflection in the washing machine. This is our stupid stand back, June. Oh, he's gone. Uh, the dog sees his reflection in windows and stuff like that in the conservatory, and he attacks himself. He's an idiot. Um, so anyway, I just looked on there and I found a Rob's Homemade Brewing channel. Um, and I've, I've, I've seen a bit of it, and it looks like this bottle. Uh, it's a beer special QV Exceptionnel. If that's got a cork in it, you watch my lights. Um, a premium dry hopped French beer flavoured with rum infused oak chips. This method gives this beer a uh, superbly complex and mouth watering flavour. Sorry folks, got a bit of an issue nose there. Um, now, so I went on YouTube to see if I did it and I seen that Rob's homemade beer. Let's have a look. The visually impaired, I'm just typing in my password on my bloody Samsung pad. Right, where have they gone? Uh, yeah, Rob's homemade. Um, so I'm going to watch him afterwards with his mate sitting at a table um, to see what, they, see what they think. There they are. He's an Everton fan. So I'm going to go and see what he says afterwards. He's only had 254 views on it. He will have 255 by the time I've watched it. Uh, so Rob's homemade. There you go. Apparently I'm subscribed to him. I didn't fucking know that. I ain't got a clue. Um, so it's got a cork in it. And I thought, oh, it's got a cork in it. Because uh, Rishi, R is it Rishi? Rishi Sunak has uh, decided to, uh, um, anything with a cork on it, champagne, Prosecco and all that, he's made it cheaper. 
So I thought, oh, has he made this cheaper? An Australian what? Hat. Hat? Yeah. What, like to keep the flies away? Yeah. Oh, for fuck's sake, I can't get the... Oh, I can't grab hold of the cork, my bloody hand's too big. Oh, hold on, I've got it. Oh God, it's a good one. I don't want it to go pop. Look at how long's the cork. It must be right down to the bottom of the bottle. Uh, it's got a good smoke on it. Sounds like your mother, June. She had a good smoke on it, didn't she? Especially when we cremated her. My mum was cremated, and oh, she's dead. Your mum's dead, isn't she, June? Yeah, I'll be I fucking hope so, because we burnt her. <laughs> so. It smells like a... Leffy. It smells like a leffy, or one of those kind of... Thick, gloopy beers. Anyway, less of the... Uh, it's 5.5. Let's go for it. I like these big bottles of beer. There we are. It's got good head, June. And what do we say? You can't beat. Good head. You can't beat good head. Oh, if you're on Scott and Wanda's live last night, um, June fancied a bit of rock. Uh, and as it happens, we've got a bit of rock that's the shape of a cock. Ain't we, June? Yeah. Shall I show them? We, 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 we went to Mablethorpe the other day, and um, no we didn't, where did we go? Mablethorpe. Oh yeah, I went to Mablethorpe the other day. Uh, see Chris the Butcher and Lou. And um, I bought June this. Well, you know, so the zoom focuses. There, there is. There is the old lad. Would you say it's to scale, June? I don't know, I've only ever been with you. I was a virgin. June's took it. <laughs> oh, fucking hit me that did. <laughs> um, you thought I were all gonna you all thought I would have put them out then, didn't you? Anyway. Yeah, that's where on about good head. <laughs> Pretty much the same as your fucker. You can actually taste the rum in that. Do you want to have a little sip of this, June? I'm sucking rock. Oh, she's sucking a rock. I don't feel it because I've got wind. <laughs> <laughs> Just a little sip. The, it, I can taste the rum in it. I'll have a big sip then if you want. It just that tastes really bitter to me, but I think it's because I've been sucking this. Ah, oh, my Judy, she is a one. Um, I've lost all thread. It is like a leffe. It is like a one of these Belgian thick lagers. It's got a lot of body to it. It's got a lot of taste. You've got the rum. I can certainly taste the rum. I wouldn't say the rum is actually overpowering. But I like it. Um, I don't know how much it were. If it's in Aldi, it's not. Will you get out that washing machine? Oi! Get out.
Get out the washing machine. It just looks at you. It just, it does actually just look as if you say, fuck off. The dog does. <coughs> Excuse me, it's gassy. <coughs> Corned beef stew that. <coughs> it is like a, a proper thick uh, Belgian beer. Um, I don't know why it's French. But that's what it gives, that's what it implies to me that it's a good full bodied lager. Or beer, it's beer in it, it's not. I mean, I'm not, I'm not one of these that knows a lot about beer. I just know what I like and I can drink a fair amount of it. It's not big, it's not clever, there's no point in fucking bragging about stuff like that. Um, like I said, I don't know the price of it. It ain't gonna be a lot. But it did actually say on the uh, shelf that it was new. And that's why I picked it up. And that's why I thought, well, I'm sure I've drunk some of this. Because it's the cork that made me think I've done something like this before. It's a beer special uh, cuvee exceptionnel. So I've heard something from... What were the places? Birds Bird sponsorship. No, I don't think it was on uh, from Beerhawk. What had a cork in it? Yeah. Ah, fuck knows. Beer orcs just. Yeah. Beer orcs just like there now, isn't it? I love it. Still got the perfect draft there. I've got to try and find a place to put it proper, though, ain't we, June? Yes. Yes, it's a touchy subject. If you have a perfect draft machine, make sure you've got room for one. But uh, yeah. Anyway, I've just been watching uh, Joe Biden roll up in his um, in his beast. That great, what is it? Eight is it like eight inch of fucking armor plating and stuff, and it goes all over the world with him. And he's coming over here to tell us to stop fucking driving our cars. And that twat's got about twenty fucking cars with him. He's come over on fucking Air Force One, a probably a military plane and all, to bring his fucking car. And he's telling us how to live our lives the crazy stupid old sod stinking of fucking piss he ought to have some of this in him this will get him going nice bottle as well well packaged it's the packaging that caught my eye to be fair um it wasn't the fact that it was new it was just um the packaging you can really I think the more I'm getting down that June the more I can actually taste more rum mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. is that you going mm, agreeing with me or mm, sucking on a rock cock a bit of both I think if um, I've, I, I come out with a suggestion last year when I was when I was actually doing the beer hawk uh, sponsorship, uh, if you do, you got Christmas coming up. Everybody panic and get everything now because I'm telling you now. In about two to three weeks, we're going to be in some kind of fucking lockdown. So, um, oh fucking hell! If you, I want tasting of eggs, I ain't even fucking had eggs. Um, if you've got a husband, a father, a brother, an uncle, an auntie, or whatever, right, who likes a beer, who likes a different kind of beer, um, what? No. The idea is, is to pop round these places like Audi and Lidl, uh, and buy a couple of these and put them in a box and just make them some kind of, um, hamper. hamper. Thank you very much. Chuck a couple of packets of nuts in, a couple of bags of crisps. Oh God, uh, a couple of bags of crisps and stuff like that and you'll be well away. It's just a nice, easy um, Christmas present to do. Just put it in a nice box and everybody's happy. What am I supposed to be doing with that now? Hello? June's on the phone. June's on the phone. She's got a mate phoning up.
I reckon if I was an old boy, well, I am an old boy, uh, and somebody had bought me that, I'd be happy with that, sitting there, Christmas Day, watching repeats of Only Fools and Horses and stuff like that on UK Gold, everybody would be happy. Uh, right, I'm going to leave that one there, folks. Um, Jim's on the phone, dog's fucking barking, I fucking can't be doing with, I can't be doing with fighting against fucking phone calls and fucking dogs. Alright, folks, laters.